Hello dear ones, it's Alice. I'm of the stars. And this is about the relationship of the dark, um, dark network and um, negative astral entity um, malware known as harnesses, heart harnesses. The relationship of those to the heartbeat, the heart rate. I've spoken of this before, but I had another opportunity to notice it in action, this principle in action, just a few days ago when I climbed a, a mountain near where I live. And it had been some time since I had climbed a mountain. Uh, it had taken me some time to get over and like dissolve some, um, <clears throat> some astral malware in the area of my left foot. And so it took a long time. But finally, the light came in and it dissolved, and, and so then I took a hike up the mountain. And what I noticed was great resistance to my going up the mountain, in, a in addition to the physical issue of being a little out of condition for mountain climbing. Um, I noticed tons of malware, uh, like, bursting at, at me, like, tightening upon my torso as I walked up, in addition to the feeling of the heart working harder than usual and the heart rate being much faster than usual, um, I noticed uh, especially just songs, evil songs really, uh, dark songs of the negative astral entities that had been banded around and uh, like affixed to my energy field flying off of me and like actually flying in clouds around me, you know, as, as my um, el electromagnetic field became more and more full of light, they, the harnesses that I was in that prevented my heart from fully opening, the harnesses that are so prevalent in the astral milieu of the large cities of Earth, uh, flew off and like, it flew in clouds around me like dark birds or or ravens circling around. The large harnesses of malware that the dark lays upon our souls and upon our electromagnetic fields, our auras, can't endure a heightened heartbeat. And the type of heartbeat that happens when we climb a mountain or walk up and down stairs a number of times, all of course within what our physical body can endure. Um, so we have to take careful care during that time n not to overexert ourselves, but over time we can ramp up the heart rate like that and, uh, and that will make the malware fly off. For, for reasons that I don't understand, the heightened heart rate uh, destroys the malware, destroys the harnesses and recreates the physical form in a higher pulsating light. <laughs> So then ongoing, it stands to reason that the, we, if we place careful consideration on our lifestyle so that it involves uh, times of, of higher um, heart rate, of greater heart rate, then, uh, then we can stay clear of the malware, no matter what that takes. A lot of people these days, they have desk jobs, they watch a lot of television, they do very sedentary things all day long, and that makes them very ripe for the negative alien agenda. So, and I feel that the lifestyle these days is, is imposed upon us on purpose by that agenda uh, so that they can harness our, our light and siphon it off to the dark. So, so think about lifestyle. Think about, even if, no matter what age you, you are, think about the sedentary lifestyle and what you can do to to foil the dark. And so then I was very exhausted afterwards and I, I went home and I went to sleep. And then I went for another walk, a mountain walk the next day. And, and the next day I went to an exercise class. And after that exercise class I was extremely exhausted. It was, it was like nothing I've ever experienced before. It was as if I couldn't keep my eyes open. And in addition, my eyes were fluttering back and forth like this and like that. Something that's never happened to me. I, I could not stay awake, so I went home and I went to sleep for a long time. 
And I think this is part of these disclosure energies and these freeing up of like the dark bonds upon upon astral earth that is taking place right now. We ourselves as human are starting to, to burst the bonds, to burst the harnesses, and to remember our heart energy that we experienced so fully during the, the highlight times a few years back. Um, so solstice, winter solstice has come, come early for some reason, and vast amounts of malware are flying off of humankind individually and in groups and as societies. Um, so, just to go on with it, the next day I woke up and something incredible had happened. There had been a great healing all over my body, all over, especially the left side of my body, which represents relaxation. And I felt in the core of my strength, I felt invigorated and strong and young. And, and today, even today, all day long, it's been the same thing. Something miraculous, I feel, has happened on Earth in the last week. Something incredible. Along with all the social and political and corporate and industrial and uh, knowledge base updates that have been taking place and the clearings of the dark, so in the same way is clearing our body of light. As, as, as star, ch star kinder, star children of the universe. So everyone, happy winter solstice. And we brought it in a month or so early. And happy Thanksgiving. We have great reason to give thanks.